All right, this is a very, very short video on how to play Dock of the Bay. This amazing song by Otis Redding. Uh, it was, it's like his swan song, the song that he wrote right before he died. He was only 26 or 27 years old uh, when he died. And um, this song was released. It was a departure from his other songs. Um, and uh, it's his most famous song and maybe one of the most famous songs of all time, actually. Um, and a kind of a standard for guitar players and, and, and a very easy one for guitar players. The original guitar player was this guy, Steve Cropper, uh, who was also one of, ranked as one of the great guitar players as well. So anyway, this song um, just really has just like five chords, mainly. I'm just gonna go over the basic, you know, so you have G, B7, C, and I think instead of A, A7, A would be like that, A7 is like this. So I, th I think the eighth, A7 works better. So it's like <laughs> sitting in the morning sun, when the evening comes, watching the ships roll in, then I watch them roll away again, sitting on the dock of the E, watching the tide roll away. Sitting on the dock of the A, wasting time, oh, E. All right, so, so that's it. Just really just those chords, very simple. And you notice that, um, I could strum it, but I think it works for the beginning of the song at least. It works well to just kind of finger pick it. Or if you strummed it, it would be like. downstrokes. about it there's a there's obviously there's the bridge in there i'm not going to do the bridge right now but but I, I think that that should be good just just for starters just working on those those chords this is really for beginners <laughs> for rank beginners g b seventh c a seventh and then you got the e in there so um there you go keep on keep on playing keep on rocking thank you otis <laughs>